A chemical blaze is burning out of control in New South Wales. Authorities are struggling to determine how to tackle the fire at an electrical plant north of Newcastle. James Wilson is at the scene in Tomago. This morning around 5.30am uh, this machine overheated. Usually at 700 degrees it now sits at 1200 degrees. It is so hot that the shipping container that it sits inside is currently glowing red. Uh, this caused a mass evacuation of the area. Firefighters and police going from business to business to get workers out uh, because they were worried that there could be an explosion due to the aluminium graphite. Firefighters cannot put water on this machine to cool it down. That in itself would create a massive explosion. At the moment, they have scientists from Sydney on the phone dealing uh, with different, I guess, ideas as how they can cool this machine down and render it safe. Uh, but, of course, the risk of explosion is real, uh, which is why there is still an exclusion zone in place. Uh, we spoke to firefighters a short moment ago. This is a, a, a trial plant that's just been in its commissioning process. And uh, we haven't seen anything like this before, but uh, the company... Uh, managing it have been excellent in supporting fire and rescue with engineering staff uh, to help bring this incident to a close. As we said, an Australian first right here dealing with this situation, a new a renewable energy plant still in its trial phase, obviously at the centre of this exclusion zone. Uh, this zone is expected to remain in place for a number of hours yet and this fire emergency could now stretch into tomorrow.